Chappers, welcome to this video extravaganza brought to you by myself, Rob Chapman, at Corner House Studios with my friends, Adrian and Matt from Video Cafe. Whoop, 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 whoop! <laughs> We've got Jib1. You can come up with a better name in the comment section below. And this video presentation is brought to you by Great Tasting Coffee, but more importantly, JHS Pedals. Uh, JHS. Uh, Obviously, as you will definitely know, make fantastic pedals. What they do is they take classic fuzz pedals of yesteryear and they go, hmm, here's a mod. Let's pay homage to them and say they were great. And then let's do cool things with them. I've grabbed a more modern guitar, which really, if you think about it, is the love child of a Les Paul and a Strat kind of combined. Uh, and. I'm just going to give you the sounds and the tones of these four pedals one at a time and you can make your own mind up whether or not you like it. Jib 1, please go to pedal number 1. The Crimson pedal, 1992 Russia, yes it's based on the Big Muff Red Army uh, fuzz. It has uh, three really simplistic controls so you avoid what I like to refer to as option paralysis. When you have too many things, you don't know what to do with them. So you just don't do anything or you press everything. Uh, using PRS, using a Fender Twin from the 60s. And let's just activate the Crimson. Make up your own mind whether or not this is the kind of thing that you might enjoy on a Sunday, sunny afternoon in your bedroom or wherever you want to play. <coughs> Characteristically for me, given it all of the fuzz, I've given you a little bit of the distortion. I'll back it off even more and uh, slightly woman tone it, reduce the, the tone. Actually, is this reduce or um, I'm backwards to the pedal? Let's find out. It was reduced. And uh, I'll bring in a bit more volume. What I want to do is see how it reacts to the volume of a guitar. So, for example, good it's a bit dark it's a little bit dark but as we add that fuzz it's gonna brighten up and sound lovely <laughs> great sounding pedal what more do I need to say interestingly the mod that JHS be gone huh, uh, chose to add to this pedal is a singular button hammer <laughs> red button on the side and this red button just gives you more volume and a little bit of a brighter sound so let's do without the red button <laughs> with the red button. Um, tonal change and in some ways what it reminds me of is the difference that you need between a bedroom tone and a live tone because you wouldn't necessarily want that extra volume and bright cutting 
uh, EQ for home. You want a forgiving, pleasurable tone, but live, it's f everybody's ears and uh, mow them down kind of style. Let's move on to the smiley. It's a fuzz pedal. It's got two controls, even less than the Incredible Crimson. Uh, so we've got fuzz, we've got volume and on the side. There's a mod from the lovely folks at JHS, which gives you a gated fuzz. It's a little bit, it reminds me of like ringtone mod when it cuts off and cuts on. It's kind of cool for, weirdly enough, sort of computer game type tones. Not the kind of thing I do, but it's a fun effect nonetheless. Much quieter than the Crimson, but you're probably going to hear that even through the stunning compression that YouTube affords you. So here we go with uh, everything in the middle. Very broken fuzz, old school, really, really old Arbiter type um, Dallasy type stuff. I'm going to crank the volley back off the fuzz and see if we can hear more of the natural sound of the guitar. That sounds preposterous and here is the uh, the mod which gives you the gated fuzz. This is really funny, and I'm sure someone here in the comment section will have a great use for this kind of sound. But check this out. It's gated. Actually, really, really enjoying that. Uh, a bit more volume, a bit more, f that's all the fuzz now. That's probably too much fuzz. I'm going to back the fuzz off. Obviously, uh, Video Cafe loving the gated uh, fuzz tonality that the smiley from JHS affords you. Oh, yeah, that sounds sick. It's time for the Supreme. The Supreme 1972 Japanese machine. Um, I used to own the original version of this. It didn't have the mod and the extra bits on the side, of course. Uh, this is a supreme sounding pedal, and it's brilliant for rhythms and all sorts of interesting chord progressions and things. Uh, so just for reference again, here is the amp. Here's the to it. here's the supreme. Everything about that sound is amazing. It just makes you want to go boof, gift, boof, boof, gift. Even Video Cafe are just going, yeah, Rob, you're completely wrong. Uh, and even more exciting, that was hardly any of the expand control. <laughs> so let's put the expand in the middle. Let's have a medium amount of expansion, which is what I need for my midriff. <laughs> It 
it's just got a beautiful rhythm tone. And what they have, slightly amount of, uh, a slight amount of buzz there. What they've added to the side is a scoop and a boost. What? <laughs> scoop and a boost. So you can do one and then followed by the other to give you interesting uh, varied rhythm tones like this. Back off the expanse. <laughs> Let's move along to the Bender, my favourite of the four. Thank you, Jib Number One, for locating this. I can't wait for when I'm 50. But I was 45 yesterday. Thank you for uh, for the people who sent me lovely birthday wishes. And I can't wait until I'm 50 when, as well as Jib One, I have another robot that plays the guitar for me, and then one that animates my skin mask to say funny stuff. That could be a real thing. Who knows? I got a robot vacuum cleaner recently and that blew my mind. So we have a bunch of controls, volume, tone and attack. The mod on the bender pedal gives you more volume and more mids, which is exactly what you need for a live situation. I love that kind of a mod. It's a, it's a real mod, realistic mod. Uh, it takes you from my space to meat space, plague depending. So um, let me give you some of the Tones with the bender. in that uh, switch there. I wasn't expecting quite as much. I'm really surprised that Dog did not balk when that occurred. I thought balkage would enter the room, but it didn't. It's just sleeping with a toy, which is great. Wow, there's so much tone. I'm gonna reduce the tone, which I think is that way. One slight criticism would be that with the mod, the tone control doesn't really do a lot, but that's fine. It's less for you to do. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> enjoyed your voyage through these JHS. I'm going to call them Masters of Fuzz. Um, I would urge you to go to your local store and annoy them uh, with each one in turn and see which one is your favourite. Is it the Crimson? Is it the Smiley? Is it the Supreme? Or is it the Bender? I'm torn between the Crimson and the Bender. <laughs> Can't wait to see the comment section and read all of your lovely comments. While you're there, please uh, take the time to hammer that subscribe button and smash my bell. Take it easy. Please give this video a like. Chappers out.